Hello, hello. Hello, hello. One of our electronics experts, I think, has brought something that every household should have. But also, if you know somebody that shreds a lot, makes a point to protect all of their personal information, or as a sweet little gesture, you could say you darn well should. You darn, should darn right, you should. Putting yes. all of that in the trash. This is the shredder, I think, to end all shredder. It's a royal nine sheet micro cut shredder that can shred credit cards. It can shred staples, which normally in any other shredder, you just have a heart attack that you broke it. That can be a little bit trouble, yeah. You've got a hundred sheet auto feed trade so that if you are somebody that has that stack and nothing, but you don't want to go through it because you're just not sure what it is because it's too time consuming, you can just throw it in there. And that shredder has at it in a micro cut way. It's a while supplies last, which means we have all that we have for this price. Once it sells out, we're not bringing it back. It ships to your door absolutely free. We have four colors, excuse me, five colors. Five, five colors to show you. We used to have you. six. Sold out of one. It's gone, yep. Now down to five. So we'll start with burgundy. Then we have it for you in your navy. And then down below, we have it for you in your silver, we have it for you in your rose gold with how good you use that for a shredder. You gotta I love only rose, want gold. The rose gold. Let's have a little fun with our shredders, and right? And then lastly, we have your traditional black, which by the way still looks very fashionable. Nice and sleek, right? It is great, great to see you. Excellent to see you as well. Uh, we only get to work together during the holidays. You, I know. You don't have me in your beauty shows. I don't know why. Darn well should. Mm, America's yeah. next top <laughs> model. We got it. Look at that hair. It's still just as good as it always was. I don't know. It's starting to get a little thin in certain spots it's here. But it's perfect that's in every all right. way. All right, so let's talk about even in today's world. I know things are still a lot very electronic, but there's so much that we need to take care of with our personal information that's on paper, that's on cards. Well, just think of the stuff we get on a regular basis. How many times do you go to the mailbox and you get some kind of bank statement? Or maybe you get a statement on your 401k. I know we're moving a lot of that stuff to digital, but we still have these hard copies of things. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately, Courtney, we're in a rush, right? You walk in the door, you get that junk mail, and your response is, oh, I'll just, I'll tear this in half for some reason and I'll throw it away. Or that you're, doesn't do anything. you're overly aggressive and you'll be like, I'll tear it into 32 personally for each sheet. By the way, have, have, have fun with that. Yes. I'll save you the effort. You tear a piece of paper in half, yeah, that takes you a second. By the way, you take a regular 8.5 and, and 11 strip of paper like this that could have some confidential information, could have your social security number, could have your address, your phone number. You put this through a royal micro cut shredder and this one piece of paper turns into over 1,100 little pieces. And now when you throw the piece of paper out, you put it in your trash. I got to tell you, it who looks knows a little like that. confetti. It's exactly the point. It looks like confetti. And now nobody's going to go into your trash. Nobody's going to find the dumpster in your apartment complex and say, hey, guess what? I'm going to put all this back together again and I'm going to get Courtney's expired credit card statement or I'm going to get Courtney's application for something she filled out or her medical records. No, they're going to get a whole bunch of confetti and they're not going to be able to steal your identity through the this. trash that you put all right, out. So all you have to do is just feed it in. Just drop it right in. I can't mess this up. You can't mess it up. All you have to do when you get to get this home, take it out of the box, comes completely assembled, even with the caster wheels on the bottom, which is great because I can slide it underneath the counter or slide awesome. it underneath your desk, plug it into the wall. And when you just leave it on, there's actually a sensor inside of both different slots here. It senses when a piece of paper goes in, it turns itself on, it shreds those pieces of paper, and then it shuts itself off automatically. For I'm going to make a depressing warm weather little moment here. It reminds me of the snow ice machine, the way that it shreds oh, yeah. when you look at this, like the snow ice going around. I'm like, that is so gratifying. Just to and get rid of that stuff. And you're just yep. throwing in credit cards, which is another one mm -hmm. that I feel so surprised that they send in the mail. And that's also something that I would never put in a shredder. And how many cards do you have in your wallet or in your bag right now that you haven't used in years? And it's not just credit cards. It's those store loyalty cards that you get as well. Maybe that restaurant that you were a frequent diner and that restaurant closed three years ago and this is still in your wallet for some reason. A lot of us do this. We try to cut it in half or we bend it three or four times. The easiest way to get rid of this stuff is just to drop it right through that little slot and it just pulverizes it away. So we've had W.C. Smith, we've had John Smith that were- A lot of relatives. Yeah, a lot, a lot of relatives, relatives that sure. are close. But let's talk about the size of this because normally I think for most of us, we've seen a shredder and it's almost like it goes in ribbons. Why did you guys decide to do this yeah. confetti moment? And that's actually why we have the three bins right here in front. So if you look back 
when shredders first came out, not just in the home, but in the office environment, we had this. We have what they called strip cut shredders. And we've all seen dozens of spy movies where they put these pieces back together and they figured out that, you know, Phil was really the bad guy in the episode there. <laughs> this is so easy to get your information off of. This doesn't really pulverize everything. If you go to a store today, I promise you'll be able to find this. This is called a crosscut shredder. A lot of brands still do this, where it cuts the piece of paper in multiple directions, but these strips could still give you a wealth of information off of a piece of paper that you don't want to share with the world. This is what Royal does here in the green. This is microcut shredding. So as we touched on a little bit earlier, one piece of paper turns into 1,100 little pieces. Not only does it take up a heck of a lot less space in the bin, because each one of these bins has 25 pieces of paper in the red, the yellow, and the green, but that means when you throw that medical information out, when you want to get rid of all that junk email, or not junk email, junk mail that you have, sure. or your taxes from 10 years ago, which really serve no purpose for you to hold on to anymore. So true. You either put it through the front slot here, which takes up the nine pages at a time and takes the credit cards, or if you want to use the auto feed tray, that's where you can take 100 pages, up to 100 pages, as long as they're not that's stapled the together. That's the stack I'll get to later. There you go. We Th all this say is that it. stack that's sitting on the corner of your desk right now that you're saying, I really need to get rid of that. Well, guess what? Now you can get rid of it in a safe, efficient mode because we're micro cutting page after page after page. Burgundy Navy, rose gold, bougiest shredder ever, and I love it. Silver and black, less than $100 while we have the quantities. Ships to your door for free. When I get this home, what do I need to do to set it up, to start shredding away? Take it out of the box, plug it into the wall. That's it. That's and all you do. Any controls on here or settings? You have your power button. You also have the ability to reverse and fast forward. It actually has a light on here. So it's telling me right now that I've actually filled Wait, up my bin. Wait, reverse if I have regret for shred? Or yeah, yeah, or you make it a jam in the machine. Nice little feature too is you actually get access to all of the gears if you did happen to jam up the machine. And also anytime you open the bin, it'll shut the machine off automatically. So we actually filled up this bin. So let me empty this out of the way. We have a clear bin to put in here. So the machine shuts itself off when it's 100% full. Pop in that new bin and look at this. This is actually showing you with the clear it's bin like what's popcorn, happening. It's like popcorn, it's snow ice. We're just pulverizing it. It's your everything. social security number, it's your tax. That, how about those $25,000 checks that people will send you? I haven't, got, like, I haven't gotten a lot of those. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, the, the, the offer. Yes. Oh, yeah, you just, you, you just got to prove for a yeah. loan that you never you even just asked for. You got a call to activate it. And I'm like, could we just no. start at a smaller number? That is so aggressive. Next time, just send me the cash. How about yeah. that? Yeah. Thanks so much. Less than $100 while supplies last. A practical gift that so many of us need in our household. So maybe it's not a gift. Maybe it's like, you know what? We've got a lot of stuff we got to get rid of. Please don't pay to take it somewhere when you can take care of it in your house with your credit cards and 100 sheets at a time if you need it. It is less than $100. Free shipping and handling. Burgundy, most limited. Navy. Then we have it for you in the black, silver, and your rose gold. I just, thanks for doing a rose gold. We were thinking of you when we made it. Thank you. Shredding, Courtney Kaysen, goes hand in hand. Thank you for giving